talk about it. Yo, what's up, everyone? It's your boy Real Will here, man, with a deep, uh, whatever you want to call this. I want to. I'm a reactor, but this is. I don't know what you want to call this. This is more like a speak from my heart type of thing, man. First and foremost, when I woke up, um, because I work third shift, but I saw the news of Young Dolph, and I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. Sit here like I was the biggest fan of Young Dolph. No. But here, here, here's some things. First and foremost, R.I.P. the Young Dolph. Secondly, he have children, right? And I think about it every day because I have two sons. If something happened to me, man, who's going to watch over them? Who's going to protect them? You know, um, as a man, you know what I mean? And, and it's a sad situation. Very, very sad situation, man. One story was that he went to he went to go grab some cookies for his mother. Um and that was that was it man 50 shots in that bakery man and he survived he survived 100 shots i believe he was throwing that shot at black uh, youngster youngster from memphis um he, he survived a thousand shots yeah i believe in cali it's la somewhere he got shot in the butt he survived that man and he got hit he got hit in memphis his own city man his own city, man, and, and this reminds me of Nipsey in in a, in, a, in a sense, man. And what's crazy is that you know I don't got no hatred for six nine, but I thought snitching was worse than you know doing someone dirty, doing someone wrong. We know, like I'm not the FBI, I'm not an investigator, but we know there was two options. There was money on his head. They had money on his taco. Somebody pay him a lot of money to get rid of. Young Dolph, or he was back door, like Dirk said, he was back door. And nine out of ten, he's he's probably he probably was back door by somebody he know. And this is a sad situation, man. And going to your own city though, and that's what I'm afraid of. I moved out of Ohio, Columbus, Ohio, and I'm like, there's a lot of murder and you know going in Ohio, man. And and I'm like, I'm I'm in Grand Rapids, Michigan, and I'm like, I can't go back to my city, man. One, I'm, 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 my channel is growing. People seeing me becoming this great videographer, man. I'm a Forex trader. I'm making money, you know, and all this good stuff. And I had a lot of haters, you know what I mean? Even while I was here, people from Columbus was hating, you know what I mean? And and it's nothing like Dolph. Like, surprisingly, so nobody got money on my head, you know what I mean? But Dolph should have thought about, you know, why you need to go back to Memphis? I understand you got family there. If your mom is there, you should have moved her out. If she don't want to leave... You gotta let mama know, like mama, I can't come here to visit you, man. I can't, I can't. I love you, mama, but and we we want to do so much for our communities. You know what I mean? We want to bring bring back hope for our communities. We want to donate our money to our communities, but do our community really love us? You know what I mean? And now we saying R. P. Dolph, man. He's on a shirt like this song says, man. This song also is Heavenly Crystal, man. Check her out. Um, check her out. She's dope, Heavenly Crystal. It's called Fly High. Heavenly, I'm about to post it real quick. I'm about to show y'all. This is her right here. Hold on. Heavenly Crystal. Fly High. We'll check her out. We'll check her out. Um, I'm going to wait. Yeah, so. But yeah, man. I'm over here drinking my uh, drink. I was thinking. I said, man, I need to do a reaction to this, man. And RIP to... Young Dolph, I know Soldier Boy and his his uh click was was beefing with 
you know, he he Glock and uh, Young Dolph, but uh, Young Dolph was an inspiration to me, man. Um, like I said, I wasn't a big, huge fan. Like I was with Nipsey, I was a big fan with Nipsey Hustle. When Nipsey died, bro, it was like Kobe died, bro. I was like hurt. Like I was literally coming from New York, man, Syracuse, New York, coming back to Ohio, man. And but this right here, man, he was an independent artist, even though Soldier Boy said he was signed to Empire. Um, but he was a very independent artist and a lot, it's you know how much work it takes to be an independent artist, how much grind, how much investing, how much you lost to become an independent artist, man. That's tough. And he put all this work in. I don't want to put all this work in and die and die. You know, we all got a time to go, but die like that. You just wanted some cookies, man. You just wanted some cookies, man. How do y'all feel about the situation? Do you feel he should have never went back to Memphis? Huh? Should he have not been back in Memphis? Um, sad situation. Young Dolph died at the age of 36, man. I'm 33. And, man. But, yeah, man. So, whew. That's it. I just want to come on here. I saw the news, and I'm glad nobody caught the gunshots like they did FBG Duck, man. Nobody's playing no more, man. They're not playing. They shooting broad daylight. They don't care who you are and where you are. They shooting. They letting loose. But Memphis is about to be on fire, and it's gonna be some. It's gonna be some comeback in Memphis. So, yeah, man. R.I.P. Young Dolph. Um,